I will be showing you how to block any website on your Windows 10 or 11. I will be showing you how to block Facebook as an example in this video. Currently, when I click on refresh, you can see Facebook is still loading. So all you need to do is to make a simple change in your system 32. And you can do this with Notepad. So come here and click in the search section. Search for Notepad. You see the Notepad icon here. Right click on the icon and click on run as administrator. You see your system ask you to give permission to the app to make changes to your device. Click yes. And this will open notepad. Here you want to click on file and then you want to click on open. You can click on look at disk in this section. And if you do not find the look at disk, you can click on this PC and you see look at disk. Click on it and this will bring you here. Now you want to open windows. Under windows, you want to search for system 32. Open system 32, scroll down under system 32 till you find drivers, open drivers and under drivers you want to open etc. Now when you open here and you don't find any file here, you want to come to this place where it says text document, click on the drop down here and then click on all files. Here you want to click on host, the first host icon which is file and then click on open. This will open it in notepad. In your notepad, scroll down till you find local host name resolution is handled. Here you want to copy this host address. Once copied, you want to come down and then paste the host address. The next thing you need to do is get the domain address of the website. Simply go to the URL section and then copy the URL. Now open notepad paste the URL in this section. You want to remove everything before the www and then you want to remove anything after the dot com. Once you're done, click on file and then click on save. If this doesn't work immediately, you can restart your computer. You see that computer apps that want to access those domain will no longer be able to do so. To restore connection, simply open back notepad Come back to this same place and then remove the code which you have written. Once you're done, click on file and then click on save or you can hit on Ctrl S. Your device will now be able to access the website. If you do find this video helpful, feel free to leave a like, subscribe and have the post notification turned on.